Okay, has has anyone seen this? First and foremost, I just have to comment on the fact that somebody put Jordan Peterson in a little tuxedo. Is this not the most adorable thing you've ever seen? Who did this? Who put him in a tuxedo? It's just, it's just, it's just, you're, you're in a full tuxedo to go on the Joe Rogan podcast. <laughs> What's going on here? Um, so uh, Bad Stats says, holy moly, I don't think I can do this. First words out of Peterson's mouth in the Joe Rogan interview are complete self-parody. I can't even dunk on it. I did pre-watch this. And I still am confused as to what he's trying to say. I genuinely don't know what he's trying to say. Sort out. The climate change one is a weird one. So that well, one. Well, that's because there's no such thing as climate, right? Got him. You libs think that you are concerned about a climate change. There's no such thing as climate. Owned. Epically pwned. I just don't, I don't know what to say. This is not an argument. What are you even talking about? This is so vapid and nonsensical. <laughs> Concerned about climate change? There's no such thing as climate change. Why don't we just do that as a sort of Uno reverse card for every single other issue with respect to uh, things conservatives bring up? Oh, you're worried about the border? There is no border. It doesn't exist. Because a border really is an invisible line. And invisible lines are imaginary. They only exist in our head. I should be doing the Kermit the Frog voice. A border is an invisible line. <laughs> I feel like that's not a good uh, Jordan Peterson, but you see, the thing about borders is that borders are imaginary. <laughs> that's, that's, not, that's not a good Jordan Peterson impression. I'll shut up and we'll watch. And everything are the same word. And I, that's what bothers me about the climate change types. It's like... The climate change types, people who are concerned about the habitability of the planet. Is that who you mean, Jordan Peterson? What does that even mean? You fucking clown with your dumbass tuxedo. You look like a nine-year-old. Holy shit. Okay, we're going to do a quick poll, folks. Um, let me know who has the worst voice, me or Jordan Peterson. Uh, type one for Jordan Peterson, type two for me. I would actually type two against myself. I think that my voice unironically is worse than his, but his voice is still annoying. So one for Jordan Peterson, worst voice, two for me, worst voice. You can be truthful. I'm seeing some ones, 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 not a single two yet. Okay, okay. I appreciate this. Thank you all so much. Two, okay, we've got one, two. Mods, ban him. I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. Oh, now you're just trolling. You Now you're just trolling. Fuck you. Mostly ones. The ones have it. So Jordan Peterson uh, confirmed has a worse voice than me. I would agree. Uh, well, no. I See, I go back and forth. At, at the start, I said I would vote for myself. But I also don't say stupid things like him. So when you add the bad voice with the stupidity, I think it makes for a more lethal combination. Do I like Kermit the Frog's voice? I don't like Kermit the Frog's voice. Kermit the Frog sounds like a beta male cuck. So that's probably why I don't like um, Jordan Peterson's voice. But let's go ahead and let him finish whatever the fuck he's trying to say here. This is something that bothers me about it. Technically. It's like, Technically. Climate is about everything. So, okay. But your models aren't based on everything. Your mo Excuse me? What? I don't know what that even means. Well, the climate is about everything. Is it, though? Uh, are, are you a climatologist? Do you know anything about this? I know that he has a PhD, so he has the doctor title, but I don't think this motherfucker spent a day of his life even researching for a second anything to do with climate change does he know that there's a difference between climate and weather is he one of those people who goes outside when it's snowing and he's like oh it's snowing global warming ha 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 disproven he's got to be one of those people are based on but honestly that might be too complex of an argument for this baby brain set number of variables yeah so that means you've reduced the variables which are everything to that set well, how did you decide which set of variables to include in the equation if it's about... What is he... This is so stupid. Holy shit. He's just saying words. Like, what's the point? You, okay, we have words that you're putting together. What's the point of them? 
where you see if you're doing a large N study or if you're doing a meta-analysis and perhaps you're doing a quantitative over a qualitative study, then that just means that, you know, you're, you're not doing the correct thing if you don't have the perfect variables. What are you even saying, you dumb bitch? What the fuck? And I, I've got to point out, uh, isn't it the case that this guy dodged um, Kyle and Crystal's show because he said that he was doing some sort of a tour, but yet he's spending four and a half hours on Joe Rogan? If you really didn't have time to do Kyle and, uh, and Crystal, don't you not have time to do Joe Rogan as well? I just don't get it. And that's not just a criticism. That's like, if it's about everything, your models aren't right. Mm. If it's about everything, your models aren't, aren't right. You're you're not even making a cogent argument, and you just have fucking Joe Rogan nodding and clapping along like a fucking seal. Who listens to this? Your models do not and cannot model everything. What do you mean by everything when you say hardest? Oh, wow. Even Joe Rogan is trying to figure out here what's going on. Your models... What models? Name a model. Cite a study. He can't do that because he's just making this up. He's just saying words. I mean, you, I, I can say words too. Duck. Kangaroo. Giraffe. I don't know why they're all animals, but I can say words too. But do you understand? I'm not making an argument when I just say random words. Thesaurus. Fart. Dog. Alabama. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's just you have to have an argument and he doesn't have an argument. He's trying to sound smart because he's a professor, so he's like, oh, well, these variables and these models. Motherfucker, I can name variables, too. Well, what, what variables are you talking about? What study do you specifically take issue with? I just don't get it. It's sad that people take him seriously. I, I don't find him appealing at all. I never found him appealing. Even the whole self-help things. I mean, if that genuinely is something that helps you, I feel like it shouldn't. I mean, if it does, good, right? Like, I don't want to shit on anyone who's looking for something that, like, gives them... I don't know, motivation, but he didn't even clean his own room. So why are you taking self-help advice from someone who very clearly is struggling to get his life together is very clearly not smart. I, I just, I, I don't know. I don't get it, but it's not my cup of tea. Neither is uh, this Ninja Turtle ass motherfucker. Not my cup of tea, but if people like it, then um, that's not okay. We should um, throw them all into the gulag. That's my opinion.